ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to a new episode of EVE Echoes. What have you guys been up to? Well, I for one have been up to no good. After reaching tech level 8, I got my hands on an interceptor and... Well, I started roaming here and there and back again, just like Bilbo Baggins. <laughs> and then it hit me. We should do something crazy. So today, we are going to have ourselves a nice little giveaway. And it's not going to be your standard giveaway. No, no. It's going to be an awesome quest and honestly a personal challenge for each and everyone taking part. Because the challenge is called the Cartographer. Because we have right here four different systems, each sitting up in one of the four corners of the map. We've got a ZTS-4D located in Far West in Fountain. We've got JSI-LL in the Far no North in Tennel. We've got P7-45V uh, located in the Far East in Cash Region. And we've got AA-GWF located in the Far South in Paragon Seoul. Now, the challenge is to travel to each of these four systems as fast as possible. The timer starts when you reach the first system, timer stops when you reach the last system. You can complete these destinations in any order that you like. And of course, you don't need to do it in one single day. Well, mostly because tech level 8 players flying in interceptors will have no problem to run this challenge in a couple of hours, while players below tech level 8 might have a hard time doing this using covert ops and avoiding gate camps. Hence, you can complete this over a span of days, and your resulting time will be, of course, in days and hours. So fear not, players under Tech Level 8 will be competing in a different category of their own, while Tech Level 8 players will sit in their own bracket. More information on this when we get to the prize section. Now, to be able to participate in this awesome quest, there's a couple of prerequisites that you need to abide to. Number one, subscribe or be a subscriber to this awesome channel. Number two, make sure your subscriptions are set to public. Number three, for each system visited, you'll need to provide two separate screenshots. One screenshot will be uh, one while sitting at the sun with your overview panel opened and the celestials clearly visible in that overview panel. And of course, with the top left corner clock visible as well. The second screenshot will be with your character sheet while sitting inside the system. Number four, all screenshots should have a red text on them stating the date and time when that screenshot was taken. You can do that using your native uh, editor, be it in, on Android or on iOS. Number five, screenshots need to be sent via Discord, direct message, right to me. This is my info card and you can send your screenshots directly to me. Prizes, we have three Omega combos that will be given out as following. Fastest time for a Tech Level 8 player. The Tech Level 8 players have an advantage, that is, being able to fly interceptors, so for them it's going to be a race against time, and this will be their own bracket. For players under Tech Level 8, we have a different separate bracket, which will uh, the prizes will consist of the fastest time for a player below Tech Level 8, and the runner-up, which is second prize for a player below tech level 8. Each of the prizes will consist of one Omega combo clone. Remember, timer starts when you take that first screenshot in the system that you decide to start from, and it ends when you take your last screenshot. And as a personal advice, don't be a dick. Don't try to cheat. Uh, well, you may have mad paint or Photoshop skills, but we have server logs, and your travels can be easily verified at any sign of suspicion, and it may lead to nasty consequences such as suspension or worse, 
Le Mighty Banhammer. The challenge starts this Friday, November 20, at time 00 UTC and ends Thursday, November 26, at 2359 UTC. So as a tech level 8, you can even have multiple attempts to try and get the best time in your bracket, while participants in the below tech level 8 bracket can finish the course over a span of several days. Remember to submit your final screenshots before the event ends. And just so you know, I already did it. <laughs> Uh, as you can see right here, I started out on November 18 at uh, 0, 0, 0019 minutes mark and I finished the run at 2.13. That means 1 hour and 54 minutes, so tech level 8 players beat that. That's it for today. Fly safe and enjoy the challenge. Can't wait for a screenshots and I can't wait to give out these awesome prizes. Thank you guys for watching. A very big shout out to my channel supporters. And I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.